This is my dog, Daisy Dukes. And while she is not a Labrador retriever, she sure does look like one sometimes. But she is actually a black mouth cur Anatolian Shepherd mix, and I love her to death. I don't know if she'd make a really good hunting dog, but we could always try it someday. Even though she's not a Labrador Retriever, I think when I make one in the Hunter Call of the Wild here in a minute, I'm gonna make it after her and make a yellow one and name it Daisy Dukes. What do you think? You wanna be in the game with me? Aw, oh, you sure do. You sure do. All right, well, in order for me to do that, you gotta go lie down, girl. Thank you for making a cameo. Love ya! You can't lie down on me, dude. I know, right? Alright, go lie down. Oh! <laughs> Sorry, girl. I go lie down. Thanks for the fur. The joys of having live dogs. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and adopt our little dog. The kennels. Bloodhound. Now, I did have a bloodhound before I changed my hunting profile and started all over again. I tried with a female uh, that I named Little Anne from the book Where the Red Fern Grows, and I just didn't find the blood tracking very useful. I find myself to be a great tracker when it comes to following blood trails and animal tracks. That's one of the systems I love about this game. But I am very excited to try the Labrador Retriever because of the birds. And I really like hunting small games, so I think this will be very helpful when I'm hunting small birds. And it's not just waterfowl. I like upland birds more like ptarmigan and quail, which is what we're doing today. But like I said in my introduction, I want to make it look like my dog Daisy Dukes. And so we're going to go with the female. Oh my gosh, how cute. And here's the thing, Daisy could pass as one of three of these colors, either the yellow, definitely not the black, not the chocolate, the fox red, cause she does have red, she is quite a redhead in certain lights, champagne, which is a little paler, and then of course, not the charcoal and not the silver. So, but for her sake, I'm gonna stick with yellow cause that's a good medium in between the red and the champagne. And I think it's the closest that we've got. So, buy a name dog. I'm gonna name her. Miss Daisy Dukes. All right, so there she is. Oh my gosh, how cute. I'm gonna have to get used to the control suit. This is like a brand new player who's never used them before. There she is. Oh, hi. Hello. Hello, B to interact. Oop, got a hold B to interact. All right, let's pet her. Hello, Daisy Dukes. Oh my gosh. You do look like a sweet girl. Oh my gosh. Hold beans. She's gonna come over here. I know she is. Come here. What are you doing? I gotta get used to all this nonsense. Play. Do you wanna play? Oh, yes. A Daisy Dukes can do that too. I need to get some dog biscuits. I'm gonna pet her again. Trying to build up that bond, loving bond there, and then maybe play one more time. That's the part of it that I'm gonna struggle with is keeping up those attentive focuses and the best friend bonds and things like that because usually I'm so hyper-focused on the hunt itself. I can already tell that that's going to be a challenge, but let's uh, buy some biscuits because I forgot. Uh, consumables, we'll buy a whole bunch of those. Oh, we're going to buy a hundred because she's a good girl. Deserves a hundred biscuits. Aw, uh, yeah, good girl. Still sitting there. To gift. There you go, good girl. Oh my goodness, yes. All right. Are you ready to go hunt some birds? I am. So let's go reset the time. I'm going to some pretty early in the morning need zones, so um, it might be a little dark, but we'll see what we can get done. But uh, I'll be back when we're all set up. All right, we're all set up, and as you can see, it's really dark out here. It's two in the morning on Mississippi Acres, and we are headed for some bedded down quail. Hopefully we'll be able to get some. I do have my holy quail gun. Now, I did just recently get a diamond bobwhite quail on um, New England Mountains. And I do want to hunt some gray fox at some point. Um, but I know it's dark, but we'll see how she operates in the dark, see what she's able to retrieve. And we'll get this party started, and I hope it's 
as wonderful as people have been making it out to be. I have been watching some content by other creators and I'm very, very excited to give this a try. Oh, there's one. Did we get it is the question. No, we did not. Dang it. Still see it. Aha! Uh -huh. We did get something. All right, let's see. That's got to be it. All right, so, girl. <laughs> All right. Uh, she is not listening. Retrieve. Okay. All right. She's off and running. She's off and running. Where did that quail go? Oh, and she's got it! Even in the dark! Oh my gosh, good girl! Good girl! It was a female silver. Nice! Oh, that is so nice. That is so nice! I praise you. Oh my goodness. Heal. Praise. Praise. I want to pet you. Are you still retrieving? What are you doing? Oh, this is going to be such a learning experience, guys. I want to pet you. Come here, girl. Give treat. <laughs> We're gonna also gonna play for a second. You deserve it, girl. First quail. Good job, friend. All right. Well, you're not super alert. I wonder what that's about. All right. So let's go looking for some more quail. Or a rabbit. I don't know. It's a little dark to be doing rabbits. Oh, um. Come on. My girl. <laughs> I'm gonna have to get used to calling her too and, and being mindful that I need to call her to get her to come with me. You're joining me now as a player who has never really worked with the dogs. So if you're brand new to the game and you just now got this DLC and you're just now experimenting with it, just bump through the internet. We'll get through it together, I promise. But honestly, I'm probably gonna need some daylight to see what I'm doing. It is pretty cool that she can retrieve in the dark. But let's see if we can find a Bob White Quail zone that is actually daytime hours and see what we can do. That is still 0 to 400. There's a 4 to 700 down there. All right, let's run down here and we'll be back. Okay, we just kicked up some more of the quail over here. There they go. Okay, there's one down. There's another. Okay, we're gonna have to reload real quick. And they're coming down for landing, so that's good timing. Hello! You might want to fly off. Good idea. Oh. Not doing so good on this one. Maybe it's a magic quail. There it goes. Alright, can I get those last two? They are booking it. As well they should be. I've hit them at further. All right, I don't know. Probably not, but hey. All right, girl, time to do what you do best. Where are you? Retrieve. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so awesome. Oh, thank you, girl, thank you. Oh, and she leveled up. It's a bronze, nice, but it's a female. All right, go get the next one, girl. I think we brought down at least four. Awesome. So this is really useful in big fields like this where there's tall grass and you can't immediately see where the trophies have landed. And that is what I've been hoping for with a dog like this. The only thing that would have made this better is if these dogs flushed birds, but I understand that they don't do that. So, but this is incredible. Hello. Do I have one more out there? Oh, we do have another warning call. What? What? Number two! 
What? Taxi that right away. Also my favorite color of these birds. What in the world? <laughs> Thank you, Daisy Dukes. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's wild. <laughs> All right, good girl. Oh my gosh, good girl. Oh my gosh, you deserve all the treats. I'm gonna make you so fat. Here you go. Here you go. I will in a moment. You are my trophy. I would like to confirm you. Uh, another bronze female. Oh my gosh, it was not. Here you go, my girl. Oh, dog, you dig your big old head. Oh my gosh, big old head. She, my, my real dog is like flopping her tail. Yes, it's you, and you did so good. Let's play. <laughs> and you're already level four. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that was just not expected. You're fleeing? All right, let's see if we can bring down some more. Get them airborne. I know I need to call her. Do they call on that or come on that? Um, oh my gosh, I'm so freaking out. Um, the only thing that would have made that better is if it was an albino and it was the holy quail, which is something I'm still looking for, guys. Um, still looking for it. Um, I don't know where they got off to, but all right, I, I probably should heal her in. Yep. So praise, of course, and then we need you to heal. Um, my gosh. That was insane. That was insane. I was not expecting that at all. Oh my gosh. Best day ever. Oh my god. Come back here. The only difference about her is that her tail's not a curly cue. Daisy Dukes in real life has a curly cue tail, but we'll we'll accept that for now. Oh my gosh. Alright, well let's go see what else we can find, I guess. Guys! Daisy just jumped in the water of her own volition! She's playing in the water! What are you doing? Go play! No! <laughs> you little thing you! Oh my god, with your big old head! Oh my gosh! I say that to my dog in real life. Go play! I wanna see it again. Go! Go do your thing. Hey! No? I'm gonna see if I can find you some widgeon or something. What is it? Is it widgeon on here or is it teals? I can't remember. I think it's green wing teals if I remember correctly. Oh, it's the sweetest thing ever. I need a thumbnail shot just so you know. Oh, you are my new best friend. Sorry, Daisy, you've been replaced. Get out of the frame, mister. You're such a good girl! Anyway, I just- I was just amazed by her doing that. She just ran out in the water all on her own. Just played in the water. Aww. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. That one's closer. Here's to hoping. I mean, I'm just gonna follow the warning calls real quick and then blast them as I find them and we'll see if we can get one. Oh, there we go. Oh, there you go. And did that one have a... Oh my gosh. Do they have twigs in their mouth? That's what it looks like. Okay, um, I'm gonna let those do their thing. I do not know what's going on with this amount of birds, but that is a lot. But that one was dropping, so I don't know. Hello? I hit it. Oh my gosh, this poor dog has so much to clean up. All right, Daisy. Do your thing. I have no idea what just happened, but a million birds just came out of nowhere. I am literally just going to stand up on this hill and let her retrieve them all. That is what I'm going to do. This is this is what we're doing now, folks. This is our thing.
Go get more! Bring them all! Okay, it is modeled female, so I do have the rare fur type um, page open just to check. I don't know. Um, let's see, these are rock ptarmigans, molting, modeled one, modeled two, so the modeled ones are kind of uncommon, so I'm gonna taxi that one and hit out. Doggies running back. Oh my gosh, what a large crowd of geese. Oh my gosh, hold on. There's too much going on right here. Alright, go away. Alright, um... We're gonna praise her. Keep sending her to retrieve. Molting? Okay, so molting one, molting two. They're very common. Okay... Retrieving a gold modeled female. Okay, that's not bad. Now, the model has two patterns, as I understand it. So, I'm gonna taxi both the modeled ones and put those in the lodge somewhere to compare. And then we've got one coming in, and I think we've got at least one more down there. Maybe. Um, but yeah, I mean, look at this. This is amazing. I couldn't remember where all of them dropped. Let's praise, and then let's send to retrieve. Looks like she's got at least one more to go get. Molting. Alright, a male. Nice. Not bad. Very pretty. I do love the rock ptarmigans. They are very pretty. Alright, let's see if she gets anything else. That may have been it. That was just crazy. We came on to a huge flock. Huge flock of them. So, yeah. Um... Hoping to get a rare white one, but... Oh, we do have geese dropping in. Okay, hold up. Let's heal. Ooh, a nice level four. Two, two, one. I'm going for that level four for sure. I wish I could tell the bald logistics part from everybody. You're tired. You need to lie down. Okay, we'll let you rest and let a few more of these birds come in. The level three. Poor baby. I'm sorry. I've been running you ragged, but I sure appreciate you. Alright, so I'm definitely going to go for that level four in there, wherever it got off to. I think it's right there. And then, yeah. Okay, yep. Time to pull up Classica. I was gonna say, that should be easy. They're alarmed, but they're not taking off. That's interesting. Okay, yeah, I was gonna say. One of your brethren and I died. Oh. Oh. Are you sleeping? Are you feeling better? Do you need to go home? Oh, you're you're relaxing. You're you're I'm I think I'm gonna definitely go for those stamina perks when we get them. Wait, what would happen if I sent her to retrieve right now? Would she disturb them? I'm curious. Go get that goose eye shot. Alright, here we go. Let's see what happens. She gonna bother them? Oh, it's just out of range. Well, it doesn't seem to be bothering the geese. Oh yeah, they're alarmed. Cool. All right. Well, apparently they do get alarmed when the dog is in play. So that's interesting. A neat little social experiment. But let's have her retrieve. I'm gonna see her carry a goose back. <laughs> And that female was just a brown hybrid anyway. Get it. Nice. Oh my gosh, that is a big bird for the dog. 
You know, this is worth not getting a new map this time of year. I'm glad that they're taking time to actually focus on the quality of each map rather than just mass producing. And they're giving us little things like this. A nice gold. Ah, uh, nice shot too. 7.56, well below diamond. All right, we ended up calling in some gold mine. That's the big gold. Oh, I'm gonna go for him. Can we make it a twofer? All right, Daisy, it's time for you to do the thing you were born to do. Go retrieve. Gosh, where to go? Way out there. Hopefully, she can get it. See, this is what this dog was made for, are these waterfowl birds. She found it. She's got to shake first. Alright, bring it back, girl. That is awesome. Good job. Oh. Hi. That's strange that she landed out there with this going on right now. Anybody else? Oh, good girl. Good girl. Okay, a nice gold. Hit him in the back. And 58, 12, 30 makes diamond. All right. Oh my gosh. Let's do this for a little while, shall we? Uh, flock coming in. So we're gonna settle down. How about we get you to lie down, girl? It's like a good use of your time when you're not active. Ah, uh, Twiggy potential! Ah, uh, is it a Twiggy? Are we gonna get a Twiggy tonight? That would be awesome. We got a diamond and a Twiggy in the same night. That would be fantastic. I think we'll go for the Twiggy potential. Doggy's asleep. Come on. Alright, girl. Go do your thing! Allards. Oh my gosh. This is amazing. I love this so much. Did a little happy jump. She's so happy when she's working. Oh my gosh. Yes, bring it, girl. Bring it. Look at you moving on fast, like. Oh, that's so much better than waiting for it to drift into shore. That was the most annoying mechanic ever. Oh, oh, oh and you leveled up. They level up fast. She's level 18, almost 20. However, if I want to use her as like a retriever, like what we're doing right now, I mean, would that be worth it? So I've got to think about those things before I actually commit to them. Oh. Oh. Not a Twiggy, thank god. It might have had to go into the room that should not be named. You are terrifying, sir. My initial thoughts are this is so worth not getting a full map released this winter for because this adds such an interesting and cool dynamic to playing the game. I mean, like I said earlier, the Bloodhound was a great addition in and of itself. I personally didn't find it useful. I know many people did. But as for me, I think the retrieving dog which is so cute because she's sleeping right now, um, is going to be a much more effective companion for me. And I really look forward to figuring out what I can do with her. And I ha love it so far. Um, aw, she needs some pets. Um, but 
If you enjoy coming along on these adventures and would like to support the channel, the best way to do that is to watch as much of each video as possible. That will push me out to the algorithm much better than anything else. However, liking, subscribing, sharing, commenting, that always helps too. So please consider doing those things as well. Until next time, I hope you stay safe and I will see you on our next adventure. Bye!